downtown market staples is set. If you head down to the market uh, when it opens in August, the market hall portion, uh, it's at Wealthy and 131, of course, you can expect to meet the butcher. 24 Hour News 8's Ryan Takeo joins us live in studio to talk more about the changes. Ryan? And it's a big move. The Larson family is moving their entire hall and store to the downtown market. And as one of the market hall centerpieces, they're bringing plenty of pressure with them. When we traveled to Columbus, Ohio earlier this month and showed you what it's like at Grand Rapids' closest comparison, one of the largest attractions was the butcher. It's that way in many indoor markets. Fishmongers, bread bakers, and butchers add to the ambiance. As the Grand Rapids downtown market's inside gets ready to open in August, the spot for Montello's meat market is empty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's very exciting. In this area, we will have a four-door reach-in freezer with product. You have to use your imagination to envision the display case or the fridges packed with meats. So we also vacuum seal and put in our freezer case. Or you could just go to their store in Holland. The family has been in business here for a decade. My dad and my brother Sam are the ones who cut the beef. Their three children help run the store, <laughs> including their son and executive butcher, Sam Larson. Here he's breaking down a beef round into a sirloin steak. When the market opens, you'll be able to see that in person. We're probably going to be the first stop, and that's okay. We're up for the task. The Larsons know when many think about urban markets, they think meat. Fine with them, but the change in scenery will be tough. It'll be tough for them because they've been at their Holland location for a decade and they're closing that, moving everything downtown. The Larsons plan to have a mobile meat locker, basically a food truck, so they can still sell the customers on the lake shore about once or twice a week. They're still working out the details. They move when the downtown market hall opens in mid-August. Now, coming up at 6, we'll break down the price difference between Montello and a grocery chain.